Hey guys, today we're playing some 9-ball and I'm going to leave my GoPro on the whole time so you will see what I'm looking at, what spin I'm adding to the cue ball, how I'm aiming and of course this time I'm doing some live commentary in between explaining what I'm doing or what I'm trying to do. So let's see if we can actually break and run this rack of 9-ball and of course I want to make the 4-ball into the corner pocket because that's the wing ball. Whoa, didn't make the four ball. Nine ball got kicked, but I made the one ball and we don't have a real shot on the two ball. So we need to come up with a good solution here, which could be cutting the ball in, which is very difficult, playing the bank shot, where I will probably lose the cue ball. So I'm going for the cut and use a ton of inside spin to hold for the free ball here. Yeah, we got it. Needed to get my cue out of the way as quickly as possible. And now we're pretty much in line. Four ball and five ball at the same position. So here I'm just going to play it in without any spin. Nice speed, nice angle on a four ball. Again, just going to roll it in. I want to end up with a bit of an angle on the five ball, of course. Mm, caught the five ball, but I think, yeah, nothing bad happened here. Now I'm playing a, a lot of left spin that spins the cue ball out of the rail. You can see the left spin helps me to get position on the six ball, which is perfect. Now we're almost straight, so I'm just going to draw a bit back, end up either straight or with a bit of an angle on the seven ball. See, we pretty much got straight. So again, drawing back straight, not towards the side pocket, because I don't want to risk scratching, of course. You can see cue ball, nice draw shot. And this was a very nice solid rack with one difficult shot and a nice run out. So let's see if we can actually do another one. Now let's pick up the balls real quick. If you don't want to look at me racking the balls, then just use the time code, skip to at this position in the video and you will see the next rack. So again, let's rack them real quick. By the way, I'm racking them randomly, so no pattern. Two ball isn't at the back of the rack. And let's see if we can do another one. Again, let's have a look at the wing ball, which is the seven and the one ball here. This time I made the wing ball and... Whoo! Now we have a very hard time. Now we have a really tough time. So let's actually go for a bit of safety, I would say, because this could be really interesting. So I need to grab my extension here. I'm just trying to graze the one ball very thin. And we have a nice safety. Turned out perfectly. Now let's see, I'm going for the kick shot. In the best case, I want to kick it in with rail first and maybe open this problem here. So I'm going to use a system here that uh, you will see soon on my channel. And now I'll put a bit of feel into the shot. And of course, the right speed. Mm, didn't catch it good, but we got new. The good news is we got really lucky again. So I think we have to kick again because this doesn't offer any value. 
So I'm trying to kick it up table. And we got really lucky, didn't cut it very well. But again, a really crappy rack. We have no shot. So I'm going for a right-handed shot here, trying to catch it thin again. And can we get behind the nine ball? Perfect shot. Deserves a bit of a tab on the table. Now, natural pattern or path is blocked by the side pocket. This is also blocked. So we could go for the jump or trying to kick from behind maybe again. So I'm doing this, need to elevate a bit, get a bit harder. Nope, didn't hit it from behind. But I think now we can actually try to run this rack from here finally. So I'm just going to roll it into the side pocket. And did you see that? How mean my side pockets are? Wasn't perfect, but now I think we are in line to run this rack. So a bit of messy, but that's the game. You don't always run out. So I'm playing that in very softly. High touch of left spin. My speed control. Just going to uh, play a stop shot. Trying to hold the cue ball as good as possible. Turned out nicely. Now the nine is a bit of a blocker, but I think I'm going for a mm, interesting shot. I not, don't want to end up here because then I have a hard time cue ball travels to the eight. That's why I'm going for the draw shot, trying to draw back above the nine ball. Now can go away from the eight, either one rail, but I'm going for two rails here. Stunning, touch of right spin, two rails. Not perfect speed, would have liked to be here, but it still works. I'm going to play the nine ball into the same pocket as the eight ball. Well done. And there you have it, one break and run and a very messy rack. If you liked it, please um, consider... Whew, I was close. Please consider to uh, leave a like, comment, share, subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you at uh, the next lesson. Take care.